Hey everyone, it's Brian, back at it again with an, another video for you guys today. And today's video is going to be all about Android and NuGet. And basically how to get the developer preview, beta, whatever you want to call it. Now I've been trying for quite a while to get it the hard way through ADB and all that kind of stuff. Some of you may know what I'm talking about. And I'm just having no luck with it. Every time I download a file and trying to extract it always comes back corrupted for some reason. And I'm getting super frustrated. So. I was looking into a better way and I was like, I saw this Android beta program, I was like, there's no way it could be that easy, there's just no way, right? So then, after being so frustrated, I was like, you know what, I'm going to give it a shot. So, I did. So, as you can see here, I'm on the Android beta program page, and then if you scroll below, you can see your eligible devices, like I have just done. And for me, it's the Nexus 6P, Nexus Player, and the Nexus 6, which I actually do not have anymore. But under where it says Nexus 6P, you see unenroll device. That's because I've already enrolled my device. So, it's, sorry, it's not going to be an exact tutorial for you guys today. But basically, what you do is you log onto your Android device, like you probably already have, like your, your Nexus 6P with your Google account. And then you log into Chrome with the same Google account, which is probably already done. So, then it should automatically see Nexus 6P. So, all you got to hit is enroll device. You hit accept the terms and conditions and everything and then join beta program that's it's super easy it'll take a few seconds for it to load and enroll and everything like that but then right after it does that it'll take a few seconds for it to show up on your phone but that's as easy as it gets and I'll be taking you through the rest of the process as well so stay tuned all right and now we're on the phone and as you can see it says system update available so all you gotta do is enter in your password real quick Go ahead, hit download, and then basically this is just a whole bunch of update. Will is it installed as a beta version, and you can go ahead and read it or not. Update size is about one point, a little, a little under one point two gigs, which is a lot. So that, depending on your internet speed, that may take a while. Go ahead, and hit download. Downloading. All right, I'm not, I'm not gonna make you guys sit through this, so I'm just gonna wait for it to download, and then I'll come back to you guys after it is done downloading. All right, and we're back here with it being done. Now we're just gonna hit restart and install. And through this process, it's going to be resetting itself. It's going to be turning itself on and off, and back on, and showing up screens like this. That's nothing to be afraid of. Just go ahead and just let it do its thing. And just give it a few minutes, maybe five, maybe even longer, five to ten minutes. Maybe give it five to ten minutes, depending on your install on your device. And this beta isn't for every device out there. It's mainly for only Nexus devices. And currently, it's Nexus 6P, 5X, 6, Nexus Player, stuff like that. So if you have one of those want to enroll them then you can but older phones or Samsung or LG's or anything that's not a Nexus is just not gonna cut it but if you want to check to see if your device is supported on this then just go ahead and head over to that link I mentioned before in the, in the description and you'll be able to f figure out what exactly what devices are supported what devices you have on yours and basically everything you need to know and this will take a little while, so I will come back when this is finished installing. Alright, and we're back. Now, it, it downloaded everything you need to, it, it did everything. Now it's just saying that we have enrolled in the beta program, allows developers and enthusiasts to try out pre release versions. Isn't that cool? Whoa. So. There's the wallpaper that apparently came on it. This looks really weird. This is not the wallpaper that was on it before. Let's go ahead and get into it. Put in my password again. And sticking with that same wallpaper. So, what some of the things that it should have added was the new multitasking panel. And there we go. We got YouTube up there and just recent items down there at the bottom. And you can resize that to whatever you'd like. And then you can do two things at once. How lovely is that? You do got 
a new little kind of icon there for it. Now this isn't going to be an in-depth look at Android N or anything like that. So if you guys want to see that, let me know and I'll compile everything up and show it to you guys. But that's how you get Android N. Super simple and easy. If you have a Nexus 6P or a 6 or 5X or whatever, then any of you guys want to try out the new beta, which is said to be pretty stable at this point since they're about to be re releasing it shortly, then go ahead and just follow all the steps and get the Android beta for yourself. But that's going to be it for me today. If you guys like this video, go ahead and leave it a like if you didn't. Leave it a dislike. Comment below what you think what you think about Android if you prefer Android over iOS or if you prefer iOS over Android. And if you want to see more videos like this, then go ahead and hit the hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for my next video. Alright, see ya.